Yeah, baby! Hey, Rox here. Madden 20 is shutting down today for the final time ever. There'll be offline stuff, but MUD itself is going away so i, I kind of want to get my last thoughts my memories on it like there's a good old retrospective video on madden 20 i'll open some packs want to talk about some things that changed here so madden 20 was kind of like a, a a big shift not only for like the youtube game but for the game itself right it was the introduction of x factors and and you could tell this was a year where ea went into it with some sort of like plan and how they wanted to execute it because after madden 19 they saw, like, I don't know whether people loved it, people were enjoying the superstars. They kind of went more into it, right? It, because they wanted to make the best players uh, uh, play premierly. Because we had, uh, you know, struggled for years separating, right? We had abilities since 17 and then prior, like, late 2000s, other ability type stuff. But the X factors to really, you know, generate them, right? We saw in the pre release trailer, like, I think it was Mahomes or something throwing the ball. Uh, 80 yards and it was crazy right uh, but X factors really didn't play that much of a deal into Madden 20 until the NFL 100 promo came along and basically ruined it right with Eric Dickerson and his shenanigans somebody actually subbed when I'm just recording a video shout out to you pastor um, uh, and so it was also alongside of another philosophy change that they had in Madden 20 which was we're not going to really touch the game that much. Because if you guys remember Madden 19, they had patched somewhere, somewhat later into the year. I think it was January. Um, there was a fall forward bug, right? And then for years, the Madden community got angry at patches because they were always saying the game was great on release. Then you end up ruining it with patches. Which um, they kind of did sometimes. They kind of did in others because games that launched were never always good or they were never great. But... Madden 20 was the year where they said, we're not going to do that. We're not really going to update gameplay that much through the year. We're going to let it ride from launch, outside of getting rid of bugs, as close to launch gameplay as possible. And that's something we saw, right? I saw in the very first week, right? Madden 20 was the closest I had ever gotten to quitting the game and content creation. Um, obviously, I quit Madden 23 in protest, but I knew I was coming back for 24. Madden 20 was the only time where week one of Madden 20, when I saw the meta of stretch and uh, a heavy contained blitz, uh, a blitz out of 3-4, that kind of stuff. I was like, I cannot believe this is what I got to deal with all year. And the sad thing was, they really didn't hear us and didn't change anything the whole year, right? Stretch and dive was as powerful from day one as it was when it won tournaments late in the year. And we're not even getting into Eric Dickerson yet. So Madden 20 also we had three superstar abilities, which also made the, the run game more dominant because it came, became so focused around the abilities and an offense. You know, offense is very much like a, a, a you can feed your superstars over and over. Like, you know, if you got Justin Jefferson, you can keep the ball to him. If you have a great running back, you can give that. But the defense is more of like a weak link unit, and this is IRL too. If you got a weak link there, you can really exploit it, okay? So... With defense only having three superstars to deal with the offense being able to feed their superstars the entire game, just compounded the effect of the run game being this powerful because people were now putting armbar early in the year. And, and this was um, uh, the first tournament that year was regs, and you saw Cowboys and Zeke basically shoving people to the ground over and over, and it was insane. They ended up nerfing armbar. Okay, one thing they actually did change gameplay wise, but the run game, the edge contained, still did not change, and therefore that the the, the stretch was still insane and then later in the year we saw rollouts happen right so we saw the ability to to double team and cut an edge even in the rollout uh, to allow you to get outside to throw corners because they were unguardable this was before we had zone drops too so madden 20 was kind of a disaster gameplay wise and it was kind of like a whole you know cyclone of reasons and i'm gonna get some gameplay here later in this video and i'll show you i just played the game again and uh, uh, uh you know we'll get to that but mud itself though mud i thought was really fun in madden 20. um it, it, it's you know it's hard to separate the actual game mode from the glitches that we got to get us a lot of coins in mutt okay so uh, I, I made a list, right, for the, like, the, the methods. Remember the gingerbread method early on for those that were mad in 20. These probably the people that are watching this now that weren't playing that are going great. I have no idea what I'm uh, talking about. Free agent, color smash, a.k.a. the Easter promo. I had an insane one too. Free agent and color smash both had crazy ones. The alt playbook method, if you guys remember that, being able to just uh, uh, get alternate playbooks and quick sell them. I think that was the one, the quick sell one with the alt playbooks um where they were you were just 
I think it was in not competitive currency. It was in uh, uh, training currency. So you got cheap training and alternate offensive playbooks. You bought it and you just quick sold it and you kept making more and more and more over and over. There were other ones, obviously, through arbitrage and stuff, methods and all. You know, we get those every year. But the loopholes we had, let me take a look at this. Like um, Madden 20, I believe, also introduced live playbooks, which is awesome. All right, so... So now you only get one on 25. So the method they got rid of it, um, uh, uh, but that was a cool method. We could, obviously you can always list that up for profit, but um, we didn't quite have the TVP yet in 20. That was something that came later if memory serves correctly. Uh, but we did have re-rolls and stuff. Uh, Team Diamond, Theme Diamond 2. This was a great coin maker too, obviously. Mud itself, right? The prom promo started to what I would call, I, I don't necessarily say stagnate, uh, because they've been pretty similar for a while, but it basically got set in stone that every promo was like the set within the set by Madden 20. They kind of had continued through this, and we've seen it to this day even. Um, the promos they put out basically every single time, with with few exception, right, um, is basically sets within sets with a couple limiteds and stuff to bring out some new cards. Uh, so it's 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 interesting stuff. Um, everything that kind of happened in 20 and everything that changed as far as gameplay into Mutt and stuff. Obviously, so they had some great promos, some very memorable ones. They brought back golden tickets in 20. Had they had not done it in 19. Uh, the community, I think it might still be one of my most liked tweets ever, if not the most liked tweet, where I uh, uh, contacted Jake and said, Hey, Jake, can we get golden tickets back? He said, Sure, 20,000 likes. And we got 20,000 likes on the tweet, 20,000 plus likes. So it was kind of nice. We got them back. That was nice. That There was a big hub blue when they were like six to eight million coins right away because of how rare they were in packs. The community revolted, and a couple weeks later, they listened to us. They upped their pack odds, right? And it'll forever be the example that supply in these games matters more than demand for card prices. And that's something we see even to this day. Like Ed O'Neill in 24 is like 3 million coins. He never got below even 2 million coins when he was in packs because he was so rare. It was so hard to get him out of packs. Even though he's like a, a pretty good middle linebacker, he's on my Steelers team team. I wasn't able to get him because he's too expensive. So, Madden 20 taught us some lessons around the economy too and, uh, and hopefully to the wider community that understood that in 20. Okay? So, level rewards um they did actually end up switching to uh paid level rewards which is kind of uh frustrating special offers we used to get these things a little bit cheaper but now when you got level uh levels we got 97 overall ultimate legend fantasy pack i got 500 points left i don't know if i open this one or a regular one i guess i go into this one i'll open my my level reward uh i don't know hours before it shuts down 97 overall ultimate legends so it was kind of a shift. Obviously, Madden had been shifting to more pay-to-play for many years now. All 97. Okay, we'll just... I don't know who's all here. Not... Oh, there's Eric Dickerson. We'll show off Eric Dickerson here in a bit in the, in the gameplay section of this video. It's going to be a good long one. Um, but overall, as bad as gameplay was, probably the worst gameplay that I had seen. Let's take the Steeler. Um, worst gameplay that I had, you know, the unpleasantness of playing... The Mutt was pretty good. Even though uh, this was the Mutt that obviously COVID happened during and like content kind of slowed down near the end of the year, that was a little frustrating. But overall, Mutt, I thought, throughout the whole year um, was, I, I don't think it's peak Mutt, but one of the better Mutts we've had in my experience. And it, I think it, it definitely was better than 19 and 18 uh, probably doesn't live up to the 15, 16, 17, and in prior era, uh, the, the golden age of Mutt that people remember before it became the main driver of revenue at EA. So, with that said, um, I think that's it for this portion. I played a game on stream. Enjoy it as we show off Eric Dickerson and um, the crew. Wait, I got to sell. Some. I got. I even have a. I have a stocked binder still. How many years change? How many things never do? I guess I got a quick soul with a massive training one. I'll show off the lineup and then we'll show off uh, the gameplay of Madden 20 itself and how insane spins the run game is. There's Eric Dickerson, everyone's favorite. Trey Edmonds, golden ticket. Moss, he had the Moss X Factor, which was OP. It's not that good in 24. Megatron, oh, Franco. I love these arts. They did this special art for the Super Bowl. I love, 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 love. Please more custom arts. Uh, that's the Immaculate Reception custom art. Zach Gentry golden ticket. That one was a hilarious moment of uh, 
community shenanigans, we'll say. Golden Ticket Megatron, Golden Ticket Maze. Maze is not in the 24, but a lot of these other cards have made it over to 24. We, we need a Rod Woodson again. Ran a 4-3-3 in like the first combine ever. Absolute speedster. That was before that, you know, the track was super fast. Anyways, gameplay time. No pressure on the Super Bowl? What? Left yourself a present. A sweaty game of Madden ahead. Oh, hey, it worked. Guided 2K. Guided, are you in chat? All right, so that is their squad. Oh, my God, look at this pay pig, bro. That guy has a bunch of 99s. Ew. Ew. Oh, I also forgot, like, yeah, yeah. This is going to have crazy movement. I can just kick this one out of the end zone. I don't even need to worry about a kick return, right? Oh, slow kick meter. Uh, who's Gonzalez? Zane? What the H? Uh, it looks like I ran 3-4 or nickel or nickel normal. So I've been, in, I've been in nickel formations for a while. I form pro. This is back when linebackers... Wait, could linebackers jump in 20? They shut linebackers... Oh, wait, wait, wait. Paul Miles is a safety. No. He's an opposition linebacker. Whoa! What the H, bro? Dude! It's a fumble on the ground! It's murder on the dance floor! So yeah, golden ticket Palomalu. Hey! Reggie White! The graphics are bad for you? Uh, they're bad for everybody. Oh, shit. He faked me out. Pick that! Pick that! Oh, Roddy, baby! Go, 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 go! Whoa, whoa, whoa! I was, like, going back and forth. This is crazy. Okay, 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 okay. This is so much faster. All right, trips tight end I remember running a lot. All right, quick base. I don't like quick base. All right, we got Dickerson activated. So we're just going to hike in and go. Whoa, this is fucking crazy. Oh, my God, the jukes are just like 24, though. Uh, twat? Wait on a second. <laughs> Wait, this is as shit as ever. Whoa. That juke is insane. All right, let's try spinning shit now. Wait, I am getting tackled. Oh, does he have a bunch of secure protectors? Secure tacklers? No. He doesn't have any secure tacklers. Why is Dickerson getting tackled, bro? Why is Dickerson getting tackled on the first tackle? This is rigged! Rigged, I tell ya! Oh, wait, you don't... There's no pass leading this game. There's no L2 pass leading. RPO merchant. Yeah, Acrobat was crazy. I forgot about that little guy. Single back deuce close. Oh, I'm in a, I'm in a bad formation for this now. Whoa, 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 whoa. Against deuce close. The biggest thing to worry about, if I recall correctly, was the 0-1 trap and the stretch. Whoa. There we go. Got him out of bounds. He's got Ray Lewis at running back. Yeah, the, the movement is otherworldly. I don't mind it. I really don't mind it. I kind of like arcadey gameplay. I just have no idea how to control anything. We got Patrick Willis, a middle linebacker. So he's going to go with... Uh, Oh my god, I can't... Get up! Oh, shit. I got contains on my D-lineman, but... Uh, can, you can double contain in this, can't you? So none of my contains did anything. He was able to get outside. Madden 24, they really work hard on the contains. Probably send a blitz at some point, huh? He's got mossed. Oh, no. Fumbo! Fumbo! Oh, shit. Oh, it's a hit stick here. Uh, Alright, well, that was a terrible blitz. How do I how do I QB contain? Bro, don't tell me there's no QB contains this year. Oh Johnson! Megatron! Megatron! Okay, alright. Nice play, Megatron. Where to get these dumb crossers? Wow, Madden 20 played well. Alright, does he have You're Oh okay. Alright, he did a really good job there. He did a really good job. Shut me down. All right, Dickerson shut down now. Wait, why did Dickerson get shut down? This guy looks like he's actually been playing Madden 20. 
That's the shitty thing. It's like, he actually looks like he knows what the fuck he's doing in this game. He knows how to stop things. I hate it. I'm actually playing a goon. A guy that's been grinding Madden 20 for the last four years. There we go. When in doubt, roll out! The same the Dickerson I remember, they nerfed them pretty hard, if I recall. No, what I do? I threw the wrong button. Whoa, okay, never mind. I just mossed the fuck out of this guy. Holy shit, he's fast. Okay. I pressed the wrong button. I thought RB would have been my running back to the right, RB. Uh, but it didn't matter because Moss just went up over the guy without even Moss being active and still caught it, broke the tackle, ran past these dudes because he's so much faster, and we got a touchdown. Uh, hell yeah, brother. Cheers from the Fox Den. All right, was it, was it a sky kick here? I'm just going to hope it was. Straight cash. Wrong button for the win. I mean, I threw that into, like, terrible coverage. Like, I would, like, I would have been pissed if I'm on defense and that happened to me. But I guess that was the superstar-based gameplay of 20 that, you know, you basically just got bailed out by these superstar abilities, and there's no other superstar abilities to unbail you out. Stretch? Cringe. Oh, wait. Oh! Night Train Lane with the CPU-based hit stick. Do you guys remember when the CPU threw hit sticks? Well, you do now. They took that ability out. CPUs no longer throw hit sticks. That was like the stop of Dickerson was basically to have an enforcer. And then you run toward Dickerson and then you click off and the computer would hit stick him for you. Goal line normal? What the F, David Blaine? Just to run the ball down my throat. He's got Bo Jackson. Oh, no. Well, thank you. Thank you, Night Train. <laughs> Somebody needs to be able to tackle on this team. Definitely ain't me, bro. Whoa. Oh, fuck. I'm gone. He's gone, I mean. Got him. Oh, yeah. Rip him down. Was that clown? I think that was clowny. It is the Super Bowl, dude. The Super Bowl. Two minutes left in the first half. Pick that. Ooh, nice knockout, though. So you're like wing tight. I have no idea how to stop the run, bro. I'm having trouble, but we're, we're, we're giving it good. So I got to click off when I get there with Willis. I forgot the click off cheese was so good. Ooh, baby, when you cry. Woo! Huge, dude. Field goal. He's taking his three. It suggests me to play it safe. Since he's taking it, you could kick a 61 yarder. Bro, how do you know you can kick a 61 yarder in 20? Jan Stenrud? Wow. One of the all time greatest kickers, but. Damn, that's a boot and a half. Wasn't 20 good for crossers? Oh, no knockout makes you feel good, though. No knockout cam for man coverage. Slide. Woo. Woo. Sliding is much quicker, too. Oh, shoot. We got a first down. So this is what do we, we do we double team that guy and then cut this guy right? I can just roll out and then throw this. Oh my god, I forgot that was broken. That was crazy. Roll out corners with Vic, double team, and if you need to cut the other guy, that's right. I forgot you got you had to wait for the cut if they blitz the guy off the edge. Wow. All right. No kickoff return. There we go. Oh, that's right, right, right. Remember back when they had fullbacks? At kickoff returners, they changed that this year. Oh, it's big nickel. Cover two. Kovac kind of just like, forgot. We're old, bet. But old. Why did I turn down Lincoln Park? You don't let songs play so loud for so long before uh, we're about to get in clapped. Okay, let's go ahead and see what he's got for Cunningham. Is he just gonna run a stretch or something? All right, cool. Oh, was it big dime two three six to stop the rollout glitch? Yeah, that's right. Big Dime 236. Because they couldn't 
double team your defensive end there was huge. Whoa. Whoa, Ronnie. All right, sharp. Is this like a one play? Dude. That's my like only superstar. What is he? Does he have like deep out? Him and him and uh Night Train. Was that the meta? Your outside guys? Universal coverage? Oh shoot. I had universal coverage and tackle supreme and enforcer out there. Damn! This is a lockdown D. That must have been that must have been the meta to run the universal coverages on the outside with tackling abilities. I know some people use that safety, actually. I wonder if he's got a cover four beater. Like, remember when Portland Concepts used to work against cover four? Those were the days, my friend. I wish they'd never end. There's my universal coverage. <laughs> Almost got us. <laughs> Woo! <laughs> oh, I thought the journal was there. No journals! No journals, dude! Oh, no, I blew it! I really thought that was... The, 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 what, what year did they introduce the journal? Vic! Do you got the arm? To T.O.? No! Man, he caught up to T.O.? That's crazy. T.O. had him burned by many, many yards. Sag. Ooh. Spin was alright. I think it's maybe I did a bad spin. Do you gotta hold down right trigger or not? I can't remember what spin's the better one. Ooh, they're all tired. Remember when fatigue was a thing in mud? <laughs> laser! Well, float laser! TO down the sidelines! Alright, do rollout throwback screens work in this game? Nope, they don't. Dang it! This ain't mad in 24. Vic, 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 Oh, shit, he sent them. What? He literally interfered with me with a defensive lineman. Fourth and 25? So you're telling me there's a chance? Is Mad 24 different? I mean, just look at the movement. The movement alone is insane. All right, W W arm punt. Uh oh, that's not an arm punt no more. That's a fucking pick six, bro. Tight end delay fade. Oh, were delay fades big in 20? I don't remember those taking over to like 21, 22. All right, is this going to be a delay fades were a problem? What do we got? Gotcha. Dude. Dude. This is exactly like 24. I can't beat the three-man rush. This is crazy. Okay, that's not working. This is not a good offense. How do you pass the ball in, in Madden again? <laughs> Nothing's getting open. The jams are insane against my uh, uh, regular coverage. Oh, crap. Right there is play really well. Wow. Stiff arm forward, five yards. He's spreading. I probably just called die. I remember die was really good, too. Whoa, whoa. And... <laughs> Okay. This is pretty good rollout defense. Be real. I don't know why my corner route didn't do its corner route job, but uh, we're getting out of that. He's actually locking me down like crazy now. It's almost like he knows the corner routes and the stuff I'm doing. Whoa. Whoa. Whoa, 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 whoa. I did, did I not have a... Uh, wait, there's no zone drops in this. How does Cloud Flat play back so far? It's because I didn't have any flat route over there. Dang, Fox, you forgot about that little guy. I really thought I could get that over his head. Zones play a lot better in 20 as far as uh, getting to the location. There we go. That's how we play defense. 230 left. 
What do we got? What do we got? What do we got? He's really using a lot of clock here. And this is last drive, ain't it? This is last drive, ain't it? Ain't it? So the out route against cover four. Do I press cover four or not? Do you get beat over the top of the press cover four in 20? I don't think you do. I don't even think you get beat over the top of the press cover three. He might. He might have me. Fumbo! 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 No! 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 Oh my gosh! The second fumble! Two minute warning. It's down to it. Wow, he got to that, huh? All right, looks like I gotta spread my linebackers out there. They aren't dropping quick enough. He's just out rotting the whole time. It's not. Thank you. Way to get him, Reggie. Three sacks on the day. Woof. Nice hit stick. We didn't force him. Come on, Patrick. That was intercepted. Take that. Oh, no. Drop picks. Still the thing in Madden 20. Get up, get up, get up. Fumble! Give me the ball! Give me the ball! No! Bailed out again! Oh, this game's ass! He's inbounds. Using a timeout here, I'd assume. No, I guess not. Fumble! Oh, Palomalo really hit him good there. Oh, man. Oh, no! Drop pick again! We don't need this! This is pain! This is hurt! Under the shadow of the Hard Rock Stadium logo, the only thing harder than this is the devastation of losing a game against a stretch. Yes! 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 We did it! We stopped them! I will say it ain't over. I don't hear no fat lady singing, do you? He still has three timeouts. He is in goal line. We got RPO. Let's see if the RPO plays. He's playing out there. All right, all right, all right. One man to beat. Eric Dickerson, two man to beat. Two man to beat, three man to beat. He's gone. Oh, that's the dick we remember. That is the Eric... We hate your guts for your entire life, Dickerson. Making them rage quit as we flashbang the chat. Oh, yes! <laughs> GG. We're the Super Bowl champions. All right, let's see the Super Bowl rewards here in Madden 20. Okay. Beamer, W. All right, so we had trophies. 30 Series 6 trophies. 30,000 coins. Midfield pack or quick sell. I mean, it's better value to take the coins, right? Yeah, cock of the walk. That was a huge sweat fest. Team of the week. 85. So the packs, even years later, still devastate us.